In class, when you're having a bad hair day, what do you do? You wear a hat. So that's why there's a hat on my head. Because I'm having a bad hair day. Class over. On to the video. Hello, my beautiful peeps, and welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a while, but we're back. We're back. For how long, I don't know. We'll see, we'll see if I keep it up. But we're back in today's video. We're gonna be doing a puppy haul. I've been wanting to do these for so long, but I never had a puppy to shop for. But now I do, because we're getting one. Uh, we're getting a Cubapoo in particular. Um, hopefully within the next, I think next week, hopefully we're praying next week. But yeah, I'm gonna show you guys everything I got for him. I'll tell you guys his name at the end, cause I'm so excited. Um, yeah, let's get right on in with the haul. Also, I just want to say, um, during this video, I'm going to look different in different clips because I am filming this video over a few days, uh, maybe like a week as well, um, as my other orders arrive. But I'll show you guys the first thing I have, which is only a couple of things. It's like four things from PetSmart. So I'll show you guys that right now. So here is my PetSmart bag. Like I said, I only did get four things, but everything I show in this video will be linked down below if you're interested in anything I show you guys with this video. So yeah, linked down below. Um, but the first thing I want to pull out is the football. This is from Top Paw. It squeaks. Um, definitely recommend. It wasn't even that expensive. Everything was like four or like five dollars, so that's not bad at all. Next, I have this snail from Top Paw as well. Um, it's a crinkling toy, and it squeaks. It's pretty cheap too. It's like a dollar on the way out. I thought it was really cute. I also thought it was a turtle at first, but turns out it's a snail. But that's cute. We love snails here. Sorry, the lighting just changed. I had to do something real quick, but I'm back to film this. Um, next, I have the Kong peanut butter spray thing you put inside the Kong. Um, I have a Kong coming with my Amazon order, which you guys will see. But yeah, this is what it looks like. This was, I think, $9, $10 at PetSmart. But I will say that I know that Kong has a puppy one meant for puppies um, in particular. I was trying to get that one, but literally as I was checking out on Chewy, it was out of stock. And I went to PetSmart and they only had this, I think, liver, pepperoni, and cheese. Um, so yeah, if this kind is good for, like, puppies, let me know because I'm really kind of, I'm a little bit nervous, but, I mean, I don't know. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm a little bit dramatic, but let me know if this is good for puppies, even though, just let me, just let me know, okay? Let me know. And then the last thing I got, I got a bag of treats and they actually smell good like i'm kind of jealous i'm like i kind of want one but i'm not going to that's weird um it's the nurturo crunch treats um mixed with berries real berries um they smell super good um i hope these ones are for puppies i was trying to make sure like all my treats and everything were meant for puppies because uh, i know there's a section on chewy where you can like filter it like click um senior adult and puppy so i was like click puppy so i don't know if these are meant for puppies which Again, let me know they are. I'm being probably one of those, like, I'm being such a dog mom, you know what I mean? But, yeah, I don't know. Comment below um, if you have any recommendations or if that's good to give them as a dog. I don't know. But, yeah, that's all I got from PetSmart. Um, I'll see you guys when my other order comes. So, it's a few days later, and one of my Chewy orders have arrived. And I'm going to show you guys everything that's in there. Um, I think I want to start with the toys and then treats and then the grooming stuff. That's the plan. So here we go. So for the first toy I have here is the Nyla Bone Puppy Chew Teething Toy. Um, what you do is just put this in a freezer and you give it to them and it helps like soothe their gums since they're teething. So yeah, it's one of the things I got. I actually got a lot of teething toys. Second toy. The second toy I have is the Nyla Bone Teething Chew Toy. It's like a pacifier and it's like bacon flavored. You can see in my hand. Yeah, it's bacon flavored. Um, it's super cute. It has like things for their teeth. Another teething soothing toy. Yeah. I think for sure all the toys I got were Nyla Bone. Because here's another one. Another Nyla Bone. Uh, it's another teething puppy toy. Pretty basic. Just little things on it. So yeah. Definitely got a lot of teething toys. Like this one. This is a Nyla Bone like puppy chew toy. It's apple pie and cheeseburgers. And bitch, I love me a good cheeseburger. So it's like, if I like cheeseburgers and apple pie, so is my dog. So that's what I got. This super cute. Um, now I'm gonna go show you guys the treats that I got. So this is one of the treats that I got. This is the blue buffalo health bars baked with banana and a yogurt. Also, this is a little dog, cute, love him, her, whatever it is. We we don't judge here. But yeah, this is one of the treats that I got. So the next treat I got is another blue buffalo. This is their turkey recipe, like soft chew ones. 
Um, I actually got like a couple bags of these little ones. Um, I got the the beef one and the salmon. So I ended up getting three of these options. Next, I have the Nylabone Dog Treats. This one is the sweet potato and turkey flavor. And then the last treat that I have for now um, is the Kong Ziggies. You just put these inside the Kong and give it to them. That's literally all the situation. You just put inside the treat and then put inside the treat. You put it inside the Kong and you give it to them. Yeah. Also, my sister Maisha did get me some treats. So at her house. But if I do go down there and before I upload this video, which I do plan on uploading this video the day that we're picking them up because I do plan on vlogging that day, but I'll move on to the grooming stuff now. So for grooming, the first thing I really wanted to make sure that I got was a toothbrush and toothpaste. You need to brush your dog's teeth. Please brush your dog's teeth. Um, this one is the vanilla ginger flavor. And I also like how it comes with like the finger toothbrush so when like you have a puppy you can like easily just like desensitize it to that like feeling which is really important to do at a young age before when they get older and you start brushing their teeth it's not gonna like it that much so always desensitize them when they're young my next i have the frisco tear stain wipes this is just so after i give them a bath or during the bath i can just easily wipe their eyes off or if they ever have like really bad like eye boogies i can just wipe them off and then we're good to go Next, I have the Frisco Grooming Wipes, and they're hypoanogenic, allergenic. I don't know, but they're these ones. And the reason why I got this is because I have really bad allergies to anything like that. Like, I'm literally allergic to, like, grass, trees, pollen, all that stuff. And I really don't want my dog to, really, like, carry that in. So, definitely going to wipe him down when he comes in. The other Frisco product I got were the ear wipes, which I just plan on using whenever we're giving a bath or anything just to also desensitize him to ear touching as a puppy now this next one i am very scared to do and that is clipping their nails i've tried watching so many videos and so many tutorials about how to like clip your dog's nails which i feel like i get it but i'm also like scared but like i should be good i'm praying that i'm good i'll also go to study more and make sure that i'm doing it right before i do it so probably gonna watch the videos i'm doing but yeah um, this is the Safari one, I think. The brand Safari. I don't know. That's what they look like. And then the last grooming thing I have with me here today is the Bee Burst Bees. Am I saying that? Burst Bees? Something Bees. Um, this is their 2-in-1 Tearless Shampoo Conditioner for Puppies. Um, yeah. I looked at different, like, brands as well, but I really liked what's in this one. And I read the reviews and a lot of good reviews. So, yeah, that's all I have from my chewy order today. I believe I'm getting another one tomorrow, so I'll see you guys tomorrow. Guys, it's now the next day, and I just got my chewy order and my Walmart order, which is the crate and pen. So, I'm going to show you guys everything I got now. I'm going to do what I did yesterday and show you guys the toys first, and then grooming, and then potty stuff. So, yeah, let's go right on in with the second chewy haul. So, the first toy I want to show you guys, which is so freaking cute. Is this little milkshake um, toy? It looks like this. And this is from the brand Play. This is so cute. I literally, I'm obsessed. It also squeaks. We stand. Next, I have these little tennis balls here, I think. These are from Greenbone Wonder Pet. I don't know. It looks like this. It um, comes in three, obviously. It's just like your average tennis balls. I was kind of scared because I know some people were like, don't get tennis balls because they can choke on them. So if you guys have any recommendations for good like tennis balls, please let me know in the comments below. Next, I have another teething toy. Um, I'll open it actually to show you guys. So this is what it looks like. It's actually rubber and I kind of like the textures of it. Um, the other ones were kind of like plasticky almost. So yeah, definitely different texture for him. So those are the toys that came today. I have some more toys coming for him as well from Amazon, which should be here Sunday. And I'll obviously wish you guys that too. But next we're gonna move on to grooming. And I have um i pet head this is like the bff strawberry detangular spray it looks like this also it smells so good and the reason why i actually got a detangler detangling spray is because cover poos have like a curly texture and it's kind of like curly hair honestly so you need to detangle it brush it out thoroughly but i think every day or like every other day but definitely you need to get those tangles out next i i don't know about this brush if you have a cover poo Please comment below what brush you use because I was trying to like 
figure out what's the best brush. I read reviews, and people are like, no, not this one, not get, don't get this one. So if you know a good brush, please let me know. But I got this one, so it looks really intimidating. Um, I mean, I don't know. But this is one I have. I read the reviews, and a lot of people said they like using it with their poodles, and cover poos obviously mixed with a poodle. So I was like, well, maybe that's good, but I might get another one. I don't know. If you know anyone, just let me know, because I really need to know what's a good brush for their fur. Now let's move on to potty supplies. Um, first, I got the Frisco Poop Bag Scented. Also, they smell kind of good, because I also got the poop bag dispenser to go with it. So I might as well show you guys this now, too. But yeah, it's just a Frisco Poop Bag Dispenser. You put this on your, like, leash when you're taking them out. Um, yeah, this goes with the end. They actually smell pretty good, 10 out of 10, so I'm really excited about this, and you know, sometimes you gotta pick up poop, you know, you gotta do it. Next, I got some puppy pads, so they look like they're Frisco and they're really heavy, how many is in this one? Uh, 150 pads, so I don't plan on using these forever, obviously, I just wanna potty train him the only time where these will be put down is if it's time for him to go to bed or if i'm going to somewhere like my sister's house or if we're going to a hotel bring these with us just because i don't really want him to get used to going to the bathroom on a pad because i want him to be potty trained outside but yeah sometimes you know you gotta have the potty pads and then the last thing i got was the frisco food mat i probably should have taken it out but this is what it looks like um, I'll actually open it to show you guys. Okay, that literally was a workout trying to get that open. Um, I'm out of breath. It took a lot of work, but here is the crate. It's not put together because that's, that's asking for a lot. But this is the crate right here. This is a 30-inch crate. Um, I read online that cover poo do you want to get a 30-inch crate for. It's also double doors, and this is from the brand Vibrant Life. Yeah, big old crate. Also, I don't plan on getting a crate bed until he is potty trained. He does have a dog bed coming, so when he does want to lay down somewhere, he has a bed. Obviously, I will be putting blankets in there and a towel in there for him. Um, I do have a blanket coming for him with my Amazon order, so I'll show you guys that, obviously, when it comes. But yeah, this is his crate. Pretty big. I'm going to set this up later today. And I'll show you guys his pen. So his play pen is 30 inches tall, like in lengthwise. So it is a, basically the same height as his pen, which is what I wanted. So yeah, this is also from Vibrant Life as well. I got this on Amazon. So like I said, everything in this video will be linked below if you're interested. Yeah, I forgot to show you guys this, but yesterday my sister, Maisha, ordered me this. So thank you, Maisha. I'm really excited to use this. I have a dog backpack coming, so I'm going to probably put this in there with that. Or if we're just going on like a walk. So yeah, uh, this will be linked down below as well. So thank you. And that is everything I have for you guys today. I'll probably see you guys Sunday. And I am still literally out of breath from opening that crate. So yeah. So you guys, if you guys hear anything, the heater just turned on. But anyways, um, it is now Saturday and everything has officially arrived. And I'm going to show you guys everything I got. I'm going to start with Chewy, then Walmart, then Amazon. So yeah, let's get right on in and finish this haul. So another thing I got from Chewy was the Palm Bomb stick. You just put this on their paw. Oh, wow, the lighting. Hello. How do beauty gurus? I don't even know. It looks like this. So you basically just put this on their paws before you take them for a walk and after their walk. Just so their paws don't get scratched up or anything like that. So yeah, that's why I got this. Another thing that I got from Chewy was his name tag, which I'm going to show you guys at the end. I don't want to just tell you guys his name yet. The wait. So let's go move on to Walmart. Also, I forgot to mention this is Frisco brand right here. And I don't know where company made his dog tag, but everything I said is linked down below. But yeah, this is Frisco. But now on to Walmart. So this is from Paws and Pals. This is his dog bed. It is 30 by 30. Um, it is gray and it looks like this. It's really soft actually. I wasn't like expecting it to be this soft, but it really is. I definitely recommend. It's super cute too, very soft. So yeah, that is my last Walmart thing. So now let's move on to Amazon. So one of the things I got from Amazon, this is a dog toy storage thing once i build it i'll show you guys um it is 16 by 12 by 12 
It's just gray, it has dog paws on, like I said. Uh, once I build it, I will show you guys. Next, I got a gray little blanket. This is like your average like baby blanket. Um, yeah, I'll open it for you guys so you guys can see what his blanket looks like. It is so cute. I literally am so obsessed. Um, yeah, that's his blanket. Next, oh, I'm so excited for this, um, is the Calmer Poos right here next is the calmer poos um stuffed animal dog so basically this comes with like a heartbeat and a heating pad to make you feel like they're not away from their litter and it makes them feel surrounded by like their brothers and sisters so they don't have like anxiety at night to help them and i literally was like i need one of these i want one of these so bad i see everyone get them so yeah i was like i gotta get one too so i did so i got a kong which i thought it was blue but it doesn't matter um, I also wasn't expecting it to be this small. Obviously, once he does get bigger, I definitely will buy him a bigger one. But yeah, I got this pink Kong here. I promised myself like, if I ever get a dog, I'm getting him this toy. And it is the Starbucks um, toy. Just squeaks. And I literally was like, I need it. I want it. I got it. So yeah, this is by, you know, I'm not going to try and pronounce the brand name. But this is what it looks like um yeah it's super cute i love it i'm obsessed i don't know if i said this already but i do plan on like training him to like ring the bells so when he goes to the bathroom he just on your door and then they just put their paw or their nose to it and they ring it and that is a way to let you know that okay like i need to go to the bathroom please let me go i got the mud buster this is really really big i thought i had gotten him the small one if it is way too big i obviously will go back and order a small i probably will have to do that maybe if i just don't go all the way in but yeah this came really big i was not expecting it to be this big i should have paid more attention to what i was ordering but we'll see how it goes next i got a set of toys um i don't know what brand these are from but this is a chicken bone squeaks and then a bunch of just like rope toys a zebra it squeaks and it crinkles a cute little donut toy it's just a plushie another rope toy okay, this is kind of like extra i know i got a book bag it looks like this and the reason why i got a book bag is because we go a lot of places in the summer like we go to like the beach all the time we go hiking at like a local park near us and um, we go to my sister's house all the time and i plan on taking him with us because they are allowed to have dogs visit and my nephews love dogs so yeah this was just something that was like i need to get just so i have it with us every time we go somewhere just take it so i have everything i need for him also comes with like two feeding bowls a pouch for like, treats food and everything if you do like this bag like i said everything is going to be linked down below the next thing that i got is this harness collar and leash set this is so cute i'm so excited i will tell you guys now i am going to take off the bell on his collar just because that's going to get really old really really quick and i just i don't like just, just don't want it now lastly i'm going to tell you guys his name now he is from a Disney movie. Okay, I'm so excited. So his name is Big Max. If you guys don't know, Big Max from the movie Big Hero Six. I love that movie, and Big Max is literally the cutest little guy ever. Like I'm obsessed with. Him. If I could have my own Big Max to talk to him, be like, "Look, I don't feel good today, Big Max. What's my temperature?" I would love that. So his name is Big Max, and the other thing that I have coming for him, which isn't really that important, so I don't need it. Like, show you guys in this video but obviously what does come i will show you guys is a baymax plushie and it's so cute but yeah that is everything that i got for baymax um i'm really excited so yeah that is the end of this video if you liked give it a big thumbs up comment down below subscribe it's a bell notification so you get notified whenever we pick up baymax and when i upload new videos and i'll see you guys next time bye